It was Atlanta developer Joel Hurt who, in 1890, proposed a plan to convert 1,400 acres of farmland into a planned community named Druid Hills. The neighborhood would be linked together by a series of parks designed by the architect of New York's Central Park, Frederick Law Olmsted. The development quickly became the address of residents for many of Atlanta's well-heeled citizens and the homes they built, many of which still exist, were showplaces. Among those who made their lives in the mansions that line Ponce de Leon Avenue were Clara and Clyde King. For nearly three decades, the King family lived in the 1910-era house built for the owner of Atlanta's King Plow Company. As testament to the fondness the Kings had for their home, upon their passing, their wish was to be interred on the grounds of the home they so loved. However, regulations being what they were, and still are, burial on the grounds of the King residence was not possible, and Clara and Clyde had to settle for a site in Atlanta's historic Oakland Cemetery. And someday, should you find yourself walking the grounds of Oakland and you come across a burial site that looks suspiciously like a home on Ponce de Leon Avenue, you can be fairly certain that you've found the final resting place for Clara and Clyde King. This is Lance Russell, and that is one of the stories of Atlanta.